now we will discuss what are isotopes let us start with the definition of isotopes isotopes have same atomic number but their mass numbers are different that is isotopes of an element have different number of neutrons let us see an example consider the isotope of hydrogen we have three isotopes of hydrogen they are protium, deuterium, and tritium. These three are isotopes of hydrogen. Protium is denoted by H11. Deuterium is denoted by H21. And tritium is denoted by H31. If you look at these isotopes, you can see 1 is common in all the three isotopes, which is nothing but the atomic number. So, the atomic number of these three isotopes are same. Hence, according to the definition, isotopes possess same atomic number. Now look at this. Here for protium it's 1, for deuterium it's 2 and for tritium it's 3. So we have the mass of protium as 1, the mass of deuterium as 2 and the mass of tritium as 3. Hence the masses of all the three isotopes are different. Hence the isotopes possess same atomic number but have different mass numbers. Also, these isotopes have similar chemical properties. The reason is, isotopes of an element possess same number of valence electrons in its outermost shell. Hence, they show same chemical properties. We have isotopes are electrically neutral. This is because the number of protons is equal to number of electrons in the isotope of an element. As the number of oppositely charged particles are equal in number, they get neutralized. So, they are electrically neutral. Let us look at the applications of some isotopes. An isotope of uranium is used as a fuel in nuclear reactors. And an isotope of cobalt is used in treatment of cancer. Also, an isotope of iodine is used in the treatment of goiter.